meaning of the word non-duality. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, so when people talk about it, sometimes it feels like uh, it's kind of it, it, it's a kind of unity, right? Or what? Like, it, unity. Unity. Oh, unity. unity. Yeah, unity. unity. Where, where you, I mean, right, right, right. Right. So you would have an object, and you have a subject. Mm -hmm. but the non-duality would be like the experience of an object without the subject, or something like. But so my question is um, in. The analogy, like in, in Monchilla's finding rest and illusion. Okay, and when he talks about the eight analogies, you know, like like a dream, like a magical, like like a magical mm -hmm. illusion, like like a trick of the sight, like, mm -hmm. uh, like the same, like a dream, right? So what he seems to be trying to point out is that reality is, is like a dream. So there is an object, and there is a subject, and they're both like a dream. But they appear like it's not like there's no subject. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I, I'm just trying to understand which which is the correct view because if you don't have the right view, no matter how much you meditate, you that's true. Yeah. That's exactly true. Exactly, exactly true. Okay. Now to explain that, it's good to understand the English or that that how Buddha teaching mentioned. There's a related truth. There's absolute truth. You know related truth and absolute truth. I'm sure you all know that. A related truth, what this dream like, mirage like, reflection of moon in the water like, all is related truth. In that related truth, there is a subject, there is an object. But that subject and object is a dream like, mirage like, reflection of moon in the water like. That is related truth. Related truths. Nature of that related truth is absolute truth. That's what it's called. Absolute truth is <coughs> beyond the dualities. Absolute has no subject, no object. There's not, it's not something, no subject, no object, but there's nothing we can see. See. Is that what is simple explain what they say? Beyond the conceptions. Conception is a duality. Duality, when it comes to the, the absolute level, duality is a stuff. Stuff. Stove of blood. There's nothing further to go. Nothing can sit. So this non-duality, that is absolute truth. That is really absolute truth. So when Zoki meditation, when you meditating or maintaining that Zoki meditation, that is absolute truth. That's what again maybe measure where things are in the reality or ultimately we're going to maintain. How are we going to maintain? We're going to maintain without subject object. It's not that so it's we have created that without the subject object, reality level. There's no subject, there's no object that we can. See, it's beyond. So that is the word. Dzogchen is absolute truth. Absolute truth. And all this samsara, what we're talking, nirvana, display, all these related truths. Even though related truth has two truths, the pure related truth, in pure related truth. In pure related truth is the emanation or the creation of the bad dualities and the, the purity, purity display is then display of the beyond duality or the wisdom display as it is truly displays. So that's the, what the really teaching said and that's what we should meditate that way on the Dzoki meditation. Is that is what Dzoki meditation is beyond the dualities. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.